Bremerton. Here's the USS Turner, 418 feet long. It has, uh, can go 32 knots, 32 and a half knots or 20 knots, 4,000 miles on two 70,000 horsepower engines right in there. And those guns can shoot 70 pound shells, 20 a minute, and uh, auto loading. And then they can hold, the canister can hold 20, uh, 60 pounds. There's like four of those. Those boats can go uh, 20, 20 uh, knots for 100 miles radius. Hmm. And they can go uh, five miles. so often it can shoot the bullet. Bang! 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 There's where the guy sits and looks out to shoot. That's what it looks like. Just come down the stairs. Here's where the bunks are. I think 57 people live down here. There's like 27 in this area. How much room they had. Lay down here and but yeah, 27 in this area. They had lockers though. There's a hatch up here. Something. And a water fountain. Let's see what that is. Hmm, here's the boat. What it was like when it was commissioned, that looks Cooler than that, but that's how it was when it was decommissioned. See, these are lockers. They're beds themselves, or they're lockers. They have a hatch to the lower levels. All over. There's one there. There. They have like a portable operating table. Field map. And here's the water fountain that they had. Down another thing of stairs. Here's where 12 people lived. And then this is where they stored the weapons ammunition. Here's their bathroom. Their shower. Sinks. Toilet. The lockers. Put in here. Oh, there's some engine. Spring there. There's where another. Here's their air circulator. And then it goes into the engine room down here. Yeah, 
Oh, I see him. Yeah, I see him. Oh, another one. I counted correctly, this holds like 77 people or something. Just the part that I saw. These two sides. And look at the shells. These things are heavy. Felt more than 77 70 pounds. Another 18 people are jam packed. We should make these hostels so then people would know what it was really like. And then that's what those are. <laughs> so down there is where they load the uh, bullets for the gun. 70 pounds into there. And I was leaving. It says this is the hull, but it says that it's only three-eighths of an inch thick. And you can look right here when it's riveted. So that's the thickness of the sh ship hull. These have electric cables. There's their hose. Don't know what would catch on fire though. Everything in here is metal. I know it before. I just came out of the engine room. So now I'll go in the engine room. These must be the two motors. Deck below. What? All the electricity just getting distributed out. Boiler. These are the engines, those are the generators. These are the engines. 70,000 horsepower. Each one. They were between the two boilers, this one. And that one. Look at the gears. Painted different colors. Just don't suck in the grease. Oh, what's this? Mess hall. Oh, medical room, <laughs> of course.
dishwashers. <laughs> oh, she looks nice. That's the battle. Kitchen. safe <laughs> with the secret stuff and everybody gets a porthole there's looking down post office <laughs> Country. Should I turn it back on? But we got this area. This is the executive officer stateroom. <laughs> With their cell phone and those cabinets. There's electrical outlet. He even has his own bathroom. Let's come out of here now and I'm going to, I guess, the captain's room. He's got his own little apartment room. <laughs> right at the front of the ship. This 
Hopefully the officer's right. Go up to the control area. There's another officer's room. Captain C cabin. little place to look from. People would hang out way up there. Maybe those were the torpedoes. So we'll walk over this way. Torpedo. Is the actual torpedo? Depth charges. <laughs> Some other thing. It's just there. We'll go down to the back part of the ship. Big area to hang out. Where's one of the guns? Took like 16 men to man these two of them on the gun and like 12 loading. That's where it looks out from. <laughs> 